Happy Thursday, crafty friends. Hello, everybody. There's old Bessie. Here I am. I'm coming on today. I know it's been a few days, but you know, Halloween. And you know, it takes me a bit to take all my Halloween stuff down and pack it away nicely. And then, you know, you got to clean and you got to oh, dust. Yeah. You got to do all the things. So, today, well, I worked on that all morning. And then, today... I've been playing a little bit. So, this is hashtag Christmas Comes Early for Us, hosted by Annie Creates. And, for the love of purple, also by Annie Creates. And so, these are my two Christmas cards that I made. Now, I got Bestie, when Bestie was here, we went to Hobby Lobby, and they had this paper pack here. Uh-oh, I dropped some of it. And I think they've had this paper before. But anyway, it goes with everything Tim Holtz under the sun. Everything. And I love it. And so, I used the lights for the background. And then I just glossy accented the, all the bulbs. And um, and then I put some Wink Stella in his little eyes. And this is all Tim Holtz stuff. So, so easy. And then on the inside... I put some of the peppermint paper, and I'm, I had die cut these and Merry Christmas. So there's that one, and then Love this one. Peppermint paper. Yeah, this one. This is from um, Stephen Duncan, and so is the season's greetings. But the paper, uh, I got a piece of it at um, in Pigeon Forge when we went. When was that? Year before. Last year. Was it last year? Maybe it was last year. I don't know. Anyway, that was a piece of paper. And, and anyway, I just thought it was so cute. And I thought it fit them so well. Now, I still had paper that goes with that. But I wanted them to look like they were vrooming away. And then on the inside, I put the polka dot and a little strip of that. And then just a little, like, starburst. So, and I put some diamond dots here. So, those are very, very simple, easy cards. Let me slide them so you can see them. Then, for the love of purple. Okay. So, I don't remember what this paper collection is. I want to say it's authentic, but I'm not for certain because I've had it for a million years. And I just use scraps of what I had. So, uh, look at these. Y'all know, y'all remember my mousse. I've used this mousse a lot because I, I just love him and and the and the little hat you know and gloves are from a different set and anyway and then i also used the stack slice and shuffle method that i just learned recently from denise becker's bah humbug challenge so i bound it on some tonic foil because it's also purple made his little hat and gloves with the scraps and then I had a little thing of purple ink, which turned out to be the perfect color, that says, Tis the season to be freezing. I glossy accented his eyes and used some um, um, texture paste for the pom-poms and the fur on his mittens. And, um, and I used Copics to color him. And then on the inside of all of them, it looks like this, which is another contrast, you know, piece of paper that, coordinating piece of paper, and it says warm winter wishes in the purple. I think those are so stinking cute, and I can use them, you know, after Christmas if I want to, and um, just send somebody a little happy, a little happy smile. So, anywho, uh, I have enjoyed this, Annie. Thank you for having these challenges, and I will link Annie in the description box below. Y'all go check her out and follow those two hashtags. And see what everybody's making. And we will talk to you guys soon. Love ya. Blessings.